And in a show against violence, the Guam Police Department has made arrests in two cases where fight videos went viral. One case involved adults in Tumon. The other involved a riot amongst students at Tizen High School. PNC's Betsy Brown reports. A video that was widely shared on WhatsApp and then made its way to social media has led to the arrest of a 25-year-old man on charges of aggravated assault. Kevin Keith Nero Royce was taken into custody yesterday in relation to an assault that took place on November 3rd or 4th in Tumon, according to Guam Police Department acting spokesman Officer Paul Tapau. The video indicates the subject, uh, Mr. Nero Royce, um, punching a uh, an unknown individual or unknown um, uh, unknown individual that was there by a stairway of a two-month establishment and pretty much knocking him out. The victim in the case sustained injury to his facial area and complained of massive pains to his head, but he never reported the incident to police. So officers launched the investigation based on what was depicted in the video. With the video going viral, again, our officers and within their department, uh, we had initiated the complaint because we identified a victim. And because of the severity of the incident, I mean, and if you see the video, the guy is pretty much, he's out and he falls from, I think, four flights of stairs down and everything. And um, there's some seriousness that can go into that. So. And more arrests were also made recently in the case of a riot at Tietzen High School, which quickly went viral on social media. Officer Tapau says the arrests from the November fight now total 13. 11 female minors, one male minor, and one male adult, all Tietzen High School students. The adult was booked and released, and the minors are all confined at the Department of Youth Affairs. According to Tapau, officers discovered that the riot was sparked by dirty looks between two individuals. In Chamorro, we call it the Anton Baba, and, um, you know, it was really childish. Something that, something that childish had ended up, and ended up the way it was and it blew up the way out of proportion. The arrests signify how seriously GPD takes crimes of violence and Officer Tapau says they'll continue to pursue charges for other fight videos shared on social media. Any video that we that, that we see that goes viral involves fights or stage fights, we are going to pursue whether it's adults or minors. So we are actively pursuing charges.